I really keep forgetting to censor out those those Steam keys. Do you really do you really even care for this game? It, no. If someone if it, stole this game from you, would you care? I would mind, <laughs> like just as a principal item, and then I would really stop caring about two minutes. No, later. you just passed the curse onto them, Steve. <laughs> Now they have to Here, play this horrible game. Enjoy this terrible game that I have spent hours pointing out the innumerable <laughs> flaws of. Just take it. Enjoy Just this terrible it. game that I played through twice. If anything, <laughs> it's a, it's a challenge. Here, if you want to, see if you can handle it any better than I. Uh, boat section. Is this an interesting yeah. boat section? Um, interesting as far as character and plot, no, but I mean, that's the whole game. Uh, Connor's uh, all twatted up in that fucking pirate outfit, isn't he? Look how regal and legitimate this guy is in his straight-up navy suit. But, I will say this, the boat sections are extremely fun. Yeah. Like, navigating it is... A challenge that's not too hard, it's not too easy. Um, you know, finding that balance between your sails and your not sails is quite fun. That probably helps that, like, it's something different out of, like, the 12 hours of just wandering around fuck all nowhere. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, at least I... I mean, there are no roofs to climb in this yeah. one, but at least I'm not struggling with a fucking city that fights me to climb it also looks rather pretty i gotta i gotta admit mm -hmm. yeah yeah it's rather cinematic uh, the yeah i think you really hit the nail on the head there is that it's just it's gorgeous and it's cinematic mm -hmm. and whereas the cutscenes try to bring the cinema into the game the this allows the game to be yeah. a cinema while you play I think that one of the big problems is the character models just look so just sort of uncanny valley close up. Yeah. Just either with like the fakish shit looking hair, or just like the just the derpy faces. Who could you be talking about? Pretty much everyone. Connor Except with his for... fucking plastic Barbie doll hair. And Desmond with his. No, actually not Desmond. We talked about that. Desmond's, Desmond's the, the only guy with real-looking hair, yes. Yeah, but his face is double-fucked. It got worse. Like, it looked okay mm -hmm. in the first couple games. I kind of want to just take screenshots of him from all three games and be like, did we really just do that? He looks more like a monkey all the time. Yeah. I think it's because they chased it, changed his character model. Mm-hmm. Because they changed a lot of the characters' character models, like, in like, yeah. the second or third game. Like, that one blonde chick, she got changed and looked really ugly afterwards. What, the one who got knifed? Yeah, the one who got knifed. For totally legitimate reasons now. We're not, we didn't kill her for no reason. Yeah, th that's not just us justifying it with Magic Ghost Lady. Nope, Connor legitimately wanted to do that. You mean, what the fuck? What's his name? I forgot. Desmond. Desmond. Sorry, yes. Oh. There's a sour taste in my mouth now. But I mean, I feel the anger from Desmond double retconning him stabbing the girl is about equatable to how shitty Connor is as a character. Yeah. Oh, he's just so fucking boring. He doesn't do anything, and the shit he does is just stupid. I'm sorry, are we talking about Connor or Desmond now? Both. <laughs> oh my god, these islands are gorgeous. I know. Like, it's... I know we're being all angry about everything, but... Oh, have you this seen this water? Yeah, no, this part's pretty cool looking. I mean, and like, the shit you do in Assassin's Creed 4 look, is gonna look even better if you have it on one of the next-gen consoles. But still. Yeah, we're playing this... On PC, man. It's where we live. It's where we breed. It's mostly, where we die. Mostly because you don't want to buy a $100 capture card. Yeah. I mean, there's that. But... <laughs> yeah, no, I agree with you. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking LPing on a budget here. <laughs> I mean, I am still planning on upgrading the hardware so we could 
you know, do AC4 in in a decent quality, but yeah, I ain't I ain't messing with console shit that I've never played with before. Yeah. So why is Connor steering? Uh, because he's the one who drives the boat. This is his boat. Oh, his pseudo grandpa gifted it to him. These, these, really? He's <laughs> he's got like the mind of a ten year old, and they trust him driving the boat. Yeah, the, the giant wooden coffin. That if he fucks up, which he probably would have, <laughs> kills them all. Oh, you know, and actually in this section, I don't know why I got super paranoid and started ducking a lot. <laughs> like, for no good reason. Uh, the ship fights are really cool. That's like the one good thing I'll say about this game. They're really cool. Mm. Yeah. And that's probably because they're infrequent enough to not be boring. Mm-hmm. And we're not a holdover from the prior games. Yeah. Yep. So this is, um, you have to switch over from a cannon to the chain shot. That so breaks the shit out of the immersion. A little bit. They have fire cannonballs. Yeah. Uh... I mean, why isn't there just a button to switch, like on the keyboard? Like controllers, ha like regular, pe like console controllers, have enough buttons to do that shit. So that, let me so get this straight. You thought that by introducing a totally new section with a totally new, you know, engine for how it works and all that, that they would just decide to take away the classic weapon change menu. No, but just, like, you're, like, in the middle of this, like, epic sea fight, and, like, you pause the game to switch ammo, and that's just ridiculous. A little bit. It just ruins the shit out of them, like, the, the immersion. Yeah, and, you know, just as a another point, I had a full load of cannonballs loaded, and then I just changed the chain shot, released the load, and it fired chain shots. Yeah. Like, that doesn't make sense. Well, I, I, can, I can excuse that for video game logic being video games, but, like, still, just, it's, it's, it's a dumb oversight. Mm. I like how half your men are just dead. Yep. I decided to take a whites-of-their-eyes approach, then realized I can't actually damage it from the side. How is your ship not, like, shredded fucking, like, cheese yet? Because you guys... I've been ducking. That doesn't... Ducking doesn't make your ship not take damage. It looks pretty fucked up, but, like, you've been hit by, like, a hundred cannonballs. <laughs> we should be on fire. You kind of are. Yeah, and no one stops him, not even Grandpa. I think Grandpa is senile or something, that he's just letting this happen. Yeah. I'm gonna call him Captain Grandpa now. I'm just, with the state of our ship, that would have been catastrophic. Ours is in much, uh, much worse, sh worse shape, and smaller. But they don't have mass, so they can't drive away. Arg. You gotta love those. I need to get below deck. I know how to take madness my body pins. I have to find all the officers now. Oh. Oh joy. I forgot how... Oh, that was stupid. Yeah, I'm just gonna knee this guy and break every bone in his body. <laughs> no questions. Yeah. No bother. 
Still less ridiculous than just like this guy went into water. Well, he was, he's gone now. Kraken got him. <laughs> Literally gone forever. Yeah, suck that for a kill streak. Eat bullets. So, did Connor just change his outfit just because he like likes dressing up to pretend he's a pirate? Yeah. Or, or did you change that? Like, he changed it on no. his own. No. Or is it because have... he wants to be like his 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 dad because his dad is so cool? Which dad? His black dad? Hate him. Or his yeah. Real dad, not black dad or grandpa. Yeah. I, He's got so no... many father figures now. <laughs> oh, I'm glad that I haven't been doing any uh, quests for that peg leg captain. Uh... Retrieving his treasure, otherwise oh. he might turn up as a father figure too. So new, new HBO st special: me and my four dads. It's a loving the story real about Native American about, story about a Native American girl and her four dads. <laughs> I, um, I've been naming all of these videos "father daughter," you know, X Y, because just. He's such a girl all the time. He's squeamish about killing people. He's squeamish about driving the boat in the thing. <laughs> he randomly just argues about fucking nothing with his dad. It's always just no and I don't want to. I mean, maybe it's more indicative of a son than a daughter. I don't know. I've never been a father of children. But... People don't bleed like that when you punch them. Like, it, it doesn't work like that. They don't have, like, random blood splatter all over their body if you're beating the shit out of them. Oh. Hey, at least it doesn't warp and move with his clothing move. It's still better than throwing mud on the front of some guy and then mud being on his back. Because then the only possible explanation is that he pooped. Hey man, if someone came up and threw mud at you and then went yeah and looked like Charles Lee did, I would poop if I saw Charles Charles Lee post time skip. He looks like a greasy, just like, just weird uncle. Oh yeah, he does not look like he's a cool like the uncle, uncle your parents don't let you alone in the room with. Mm-hmm. Because he's got a van. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> As though you're the innocent one, and they the thieves. It's all a matter of perspective. He, like, stabbed him in the fucking heart. How is he still talking? No, no, Connor stabbed him in the side. <sighs> How is he still talking after Haytham beat the shit out of his face is the bigger question. Oh. I think he's, like, I don't think that's, I think that's just the most extreme case of chicken pox I've ever seen. Because that oh, doesn't man, even look diseased. that doesn't even look like blood. Like <laughs> blood doesn't act like that. It's all crusted already and on his hands. Oh no! It's just like I can understand like the the shit coming out of his mouth. I don't understand the shit on his like. I, I especially don't understand the shit on his hand because if he's like cl clutching a wound, it'd be like all over his hands, not spotty like that. So yeah. I you know. I don't know, this game kind of just fails on so many basic levels. Yeah. You know, on the on the good side, that was one of... <laughs> this is going to sound stupid since we just talked over the whole thing. That was one of the best uh, Templar post-death monologues, talking about how... Are you serious? Like, this is so gray. Yeah. Like, really. Uh, now I kind of, I know I kind of disappointed I didn't listen to it. Uh, you can go back and hear it again. No, I'm not, it, it, I'm not gonna watch it again, not for this game. <laughs> if, if we're, you know, 42 episodes in, pretty much, and now we're just getting a guy who's like, oh, but have you ever thought of it from our point of view, jackass? Like, if we're there at now, you're not missing much.